friends, what's up? So today I'm gonna have Sana turn me in, into like a bride, like a full glam bride, the bridal makeup I will never have. Eddie, I've given Eddie. her full control, but you know what I'm gonna do before we start? I'm gonna do my own brows. Yes. And this is one thing that I think Sana and I both learned from getting our makeup done, that if you're gonna get your makeup done and you know how you like your brows, do your brows and lipsticks yourself. yourself. Yeah. Cause it's just better. If you're good at doing your own brows and lipsticks, just do it. Just do it yourself. I'm gonna use my Benefit, is it gonna focus? The Foolproof Brow Powder. Okay, you guys can, you know I love this shit, okay? So it's the Foolproof <laughs> Brow Powder and I like it because it has like the two tones. I always just mix them and I'm just filling in the ends of my brows like always. I don't do anything fancy, especially since I got them microbladed. And then I'm gonna go in with the 24 hour brow setter. And this shit is good because it's clear and it's literally like glue for your eyebrows. And if you have long eyebrow hair like me, you will know that sometimes when you do your makeup, your eyebrow hair starts to fall. And then in your pictures, it's just like a little spike. Yeah, I so, hate when that happens. Yeah, this. Is good. Especially when you have lo long eyebrows. Yeah, and we have long eyebrows. Yeah. And it doesn't make your eyebrows too crunchy. I don't like the crunchy feeling either. Yeah, where it's gross. just stuck to you. Yeah. And you feel like if you touch your eyebrow, like everything uh, will just go yeah. everywhere. So we're gonna do for Sally Skin Tune Blur as primer. I like, you know those, I like like the pore professional, the ones that are thicker. Oh, this is the more one that like your serum pores. Yeah. This one's more serum y. This one's more it's not like bad. a base. I think you could still use a primer on top of this. Yeah, but... and it smells like cucumbers. It smells good. Do you ever... I asked my mom this question when she did my makeup. Do you feel weird touching people's face? Uh, I'm used to it now because oh. I've done like so many, but it would be really weird. Like I feel weird even touching my own face and then... You're when weird I, Like... Touching your own face? Like really? it's just weird and then... Really? So I just always imagine. Really? What are you looking for? Because really? we have a bunch of shit here. <laughs> if I was to like just show you guys what is going on, you'd be like, wow. They would have a heart attack. What do you need? Um, okay. Close so eyes. if you guys don't know Sana actually does this freelance work I get emails constantly on people like that want me to do their makeup for their wedding or their reception or their prom and stuff I just don't it's nothing it's something that I've never been interested in but Sana does it so I'll leave her email in the description or on it or what should they just send yeah. you like a DM yeah you can send me a DM or um, her info is gonna be like in the description or email me on yeah when you get to my Profile. Just like go on her profile and if you guys want freelance uh, like makeup. She's your girl. Wait, you've done my makeup Way once. back though. You know what I did? All I took was a black <laughs> eyeshadow. Your dad liked it. I, I took a black eyeshadow and I just smeared it all over her face. It was so funny. I died laughing. Your dad liked it though. My dad was like, wow. I was like, oh look, I look so pretty. Your dad liked it. Yeah, and that was like and when then, it was, I was probably 19 and that was when yeah. we, all we did was just black smoky eye. Oh. I want to do a video on how I used to do my makeup. Yes. Do you remember when we used to go out? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Can like when I first met what? Sana, it God. wasn't ugly, but it was completely different than how I do my makeup now. My <laughs> eyebrows were not done. <laughs> Really, Cheddar? Excuse us while our guard dog takes <laughs> care of the bad guys. Oh, you're supposed to like, you know you're like the makeup artist here, so you're supposed to oh, tell I'm them. I'm supposed to tell them? You're okay. supposed to tell them well, what you're doing? I'm using the Tart... Tartist. Tartist Pro. And in these two colors, mixing this one and this one. Right in the inner corner of the eye. Outer corner. Oh, outer corner of oh the God. eye. Oh god. I don't- I'm trying to remember when I transitioned from doing dramatic makeup to light makeup. I know, I was like, just looking back at your videos the other day and I was like, because you used to do a lot of like bridal, bri yeah. like glittery... Yeah, like when did I stop and why? And then it just became like super natural. Yeah. Even though natural is nice. I just don't- I, I don't know like, why, I don't- I don't know. You know what's- okay, here, the way I always explain it is that if let's say you go out, most of the time girls go out at nighttime, no one is gonna see your black smoky glittery eye. It just, yeah. in the dark, it all looks the same. So for me, I was like, oh, I'm just gonna save some time and like not do <laughs> a dark smoky eye or like I crazy remember, makeup yeah. because in the dark, no one's gonna be able to see it. And then I just got super lazy. I think it's laziness out of more than anything. You told me that too. You were like, Sana, so anyways, nobody's gonna <laughs> see the eyeshadow. So what's the point? That's true. So I'm going with a darker shade now, mixing this with this brown over Look at, they here. see all my mess. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, it's too late. There this you go. <laughs> I'm not gonna edit it out. Take this brown with this brown. <laughs> but the thing is, it's not dirty. It's like, it's not dirt. It's, it's just a lot of things. Right. But I can find them all. Yeah, she can find them all. Yeah. I don't know how. 
So she's just, what are you doing? Darkening out. Are you doing like a smoky I'm just wing? I'm smoky, like smoking it out and then I'm going to put an eyeliner too, but first I'm smoking out just with eyeshadow. What is everyone being for Halloween? I really want to do a few Halloween looks that I was telling Sana yesterday. Yeah. It'll be so fun. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to turn Osama and Sana into something. I want to see if they both, well, Sana is always down. I'm always but down. I want to see if Osama will make time out for me to like turn them into something. So now I'm using the Stella glitter and this one is in Kitten Karma and it looks like this. Are we gonna do like a maroon lip? Are we gonna go all out? Yeah. <gasps> So now she's just wiping off the bottom. You know it's funny because a lot of YouTubers that I watch, they do their eye, they do their foundation, concealer, and then eyeshadow, yeah. and I don't get why because especially if you're doing a dramatic look, it, there's you're gonna have fallout. You're gonna mess something up, and it's just easier if you do everything concealer and stuff after. Yeah, I don't understand how it doesn't yeah. fall out, or I guess they just fix it after they but fix it, it. i've seen I, a lot I of them they just wipe it off cakey, or like, like they'll put powder underneath but i just prefer to have like i don't know i, I feel yeah. like it would get too cakey if you did like yeah try to fix it after okay. on top of that i don't know and i think like that's a lot of mistakes sometimes makeup artists like people sometimes when i've seen them do other people's makeup like with you when you were doing your bridal trials yeah. i'm just gonna be straight up like when sana was doing her bridal tri trials before she ended up picking sabrina we went to a few people and like they would they were putting like Concealer and then powder and then they wanted more coverage So then they would put more concealer and then more powder on top of that, but then it just ended up looking like a Cakey mess. mess. Yeah, and like Sana was creasing in places. I've never seen her have wrinkles before. It was just not good <laughs> Yeah, I, I think we gave up at one point. I was just like I'm just doing, doing your own makeup. My yeah. own makeup Yeah, cuz It's hard to find I someone. don't want to cry on the wedding day Alana time. I usually use Inglot for brides oh, because it doesn't move ever. Inglot? I've heard good things about that. I just never, I can't use gel liner. Yeah. So you, next best thing is NYX. NYX. Liba's favorite. My matte liquid liner. I love this. I want to do a video where I turn my mom into me. Or you into me. A red wig. I have a red wig. Another reason I don't like getting my makeup done is someone's all up in my face at all times. And I don't like that. I like indirectly hold my breath. Sonny, you're so annoying. <laughs> you know when you're scared your breath smells, but you know it doesn't, but then you're still scared it smells, so yeah. you just hold your breath. And don't, wow. don't breathe. The eyeliner switched up. Don't the whole look. breathe. Okay, so we're gonna go do the other eye. We will BRB. And now we're gonna move on to the face. And I want. I'm the bride. Okay, I'm Bridezilla. I want a full face. Okay. I don't want any of my natural anything to show. <laughs> full on contour. Full on contour. Full on everything. Okay. So first we're putting on primer and that's the Tarte Quench Hydrating Primer. If we're gonna go cake face, we're gonna need her face completely hydrated. I, ha I haven't seen you in a full contoured face actually, so let's try that. We're going for full actual bride, like how a bride would do her makeup. No, and like granted, not all brides would do their makeup like this. Like I probably would not, but like. Okay, you know. next up, I'm gonna use the iconic illuminator. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna put it all over her face. I've never done this before. Yep, I know you've never done this before. I'm not excited for this. <laughs> I don't like. Glowy skin. I love glow. Like skin. all over glowy skin, you know? I like a highlight. <laughs> look at your face. <laughs> yeah, because I'm looking at it in the in the thing and it does not look cute. Look, see here's why I don't like it, because it like accentuates all your pores. Like now all of a sudden you guys can oops, didn't mean to flick you off, but kinda did. <laughs> but <laughs> you can see like all my pores. Do you guys get what I'm saying though? This is why a lot of people with acne don't well, highlight yeah, their face. don't highlight their face, you know? This is why you put it on before. So then it gets all hidden away. Look at your face. Look at look at it. I look like a greasy mess. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'll trust the process. Oh my god. Next up, we're using the MAC Studio Fix and NC25. This is my favorite foundation. Sun is one of the only people I know that still uses MAC foundation. I tried it once in high school and it broke me out bad. The bomb. Really? But okay, there's one that breaks you out. This is not it. Uh, Cause the one breaks oh, me out Oh, this looks too. like it's a thick. Oh, damn. This is what you wore? Every time you do your makeup. Uh, Like when you go out-ish. Yep. Yeah. Really? Yep. Yeah. Cause damn, after a bro, while- This is super full coverage. This goes away. So every day I only wear concealer, but like when I go out, I'll yeah. put on 
this foundation. You should do videos recreating your makeup looks from your wedding. Yeah. I mean, I might end up liking it. Because all the foundations I use, you know when you want a thick coverage? Yeah. I don't, I don't get it from them. And then you have to like use it like You have to times. use like three times or like, you know. Well, this one you just go over once, once. and then you're wow. good. You guys, it looks like I got punched in my face. That's how bad my eye bags look. That's how full coverage it is. It's in my eye bag. Do you look? Do you see it? Look. <gasps> you look like a vampire. No. Yeah, I usually I never go with foundation underneath my eyes. I'm just like a really yellow person. My undertone yeah, is yeah. so yellow. But you can't get any more yellower than MAC. Than MAC. Foundations. Yeah. Like yeah. it's the yellowest foundation of life. Like look at how yeah, yellow that's, this is. Yeah, that's true. But I feel like the yellow makes you glowy. I don't know. I like yellow over I don't pink. like pink tones at all. Yeah, on know. our skin tone. Time for concealer. Let's use the oh, Huda Beauty somewhere. concealer in Sugar Biscuit. Her new ones. I like her um, applicator. Yeah. Me too. It's pretty cool. I was shocked that I actually liked the concealer. Mm -hmm. And then we're just going to go in and what do we do before beauty blenders? I'm so like I like brushes, forget. but I mean if you but think I about never, it, never like, like what was that? It doesn't like, even blend it properly. I feel like it pulls out all yeah. your dry skin and it leaves streaks. Yeah, let's do her. Oh, wow, bake. I've never okay. had. I have, it's been a while since I've had a full coverage like this. For brides, I feel you because like regular Indian Pakistani clothing are like is like so uncomfortable. I can only imagine a bride. Imagine? I can only imagine. But you know, I know how it feels. But kind of, but not really. But I don't know what I'm saying. Do you, ever, you guys ever just open your phone to see if you have any notifications after like an hour and then you check it and then there's no <laughs> notifications and then you get sad and you're like, maybe if I check in two hours. <laughs> but then there's still no notification. Well, that's because you don't have like the Instagram thing. Yeah, I mean, who wants to see Instagram notifications? So I, yeah, I use the, um, do you see how it's yellow? Yeah. Banana the bread? Uh, I really like it. Bread. You use pound cake? Yeah. Okay. I feel like it doesn't leave as much of a flashback because I once tried the lighter one and when I took pictures in Miami. Actually, yeah, the one that I use is, is pretty white. Mm -hmm. But that's why I use it like very little. Lightly. But maybe I'll try this one. Yeah, banana bread. I think Contour. I might even end up getting this foundation because like, what the fuck? Right? I told you. Because it's like the full coverage that I would want if yeah. I ever wanted it. Yeah. Oh, good. Um, and it dries really fast. Like, like do one side and then oh. do the other side. <laughs> you never saw my video, did you? Watch, you'll see. You know what's really good though? Um, the Makeup Forever, the foundation sticks. If you I've get it in a darker those. one, that's the one Sabina used on us. Oh. Or on me at least. I don't know if yeah, she yeah, used Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what she used. Yeah, and it was so good. It looked really nice. I'm going to try those. Oh, this blended out nice. Mine, but you see what I mean where it, it dries really fast, it leaves a streak. And that line. Yeah. And what color is this? It's the butterscotch. Butterscotch. I really think I like this foundation. I'm gonna see. Thing is for me, like I don't ever go anywhere that needs this kind of full coverage. <laughs> My big ass forehead. It keeps getting bigger. Right, because you keep getting smarter. Yeah, that's 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 the theory. <laughs> Tarte uh, Princess Park Avenue Princess bronzer on top. I might just make it deeper. I don't know why I like the forehead like contoured. Me too. Right? Like I feel like it brings it's, the makeup yeah. together. It looks really good. Teeth like who somehow? is this messaging me? It's Ozer. Obviously. Obviously. Damn it, I should have acted here. like it was someone else. Yeah. But no, guys, maybe they maybe they I am doing a trial right now. They don't have the Maybe I'm actually just trying to see what kind of makeup I want. Psych. <laughs> don't get them excited. It's not even I think that they're not, it's not excited. I think people are just curious to see what my taste is. I think at this point, like, let's be real. And I think they just want, yeah, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, yeah. I think they're just curious to see, like, who, who? or... Which psychopath would mess with me? <laughs> like, with who would want to be with that <laughs> as a me? Everybody over there is like, me, me, me. <laughs> okay, we're gonna use the NYX Sweet Cheeks palette. Mix the peach with the bright pink. You gotta put lots of blush on. I have to be a blushing bride. 
you hear the dog upstairs? Yep. I told you guys, I figured out it's not elephants upstairs. It's just one big dog and then the owners just don't care. They walk with their heels on the floor. It's, it's great. They wake up at seven o'clock for work. I know this because I hear them. <laughs> and Laba wakes up with them I do. Morning. And I'm like, ah. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, so I want to do a video. I don't know if it's like, you can tell me because I don't know if it's like, not that if it's appropriate. So there's like, there was a video going around last year where people got Tinder profiles and then they swiped right. So they accepted everybody. Yeah. And then they just read out the comment. Like they didn't show the person cause that's obviously like, that would be so mean. I, like I would never, Yeah. but um, they just read out the funny uh, oh taglines or like, like the pickup lines. The funny pickup lines that like people w had sent. Yeah, that would be pretty funny. Right? Let's do that. Will we use your picture? Yeah, like I'll, I'll go out as me. Okay. Right? And then we would just see what people like sent me as a as a um, pickup line. I think it will be funny. Because honestly, you guys, like I know it's the era of apps and the era of the internet, but I'm, I'm not with someone that can like get with dating apps. Like no offense. Like I'm really not trying to be rude, <laughs> but it's like you're sitting there and you're just spending time that you could be spending on something else just swiping looking for somebody to date i don't know that's just you get what i mean i just like i guess because you I, now it's like where do they meet in person that's right? true because like, most people yeah i get either it. you meet them at school or at work and if you don't go to either that's actually very true or if you it. work in a place where you're not meeting a lot of people then, then yeah what that's true which you, i'm in that category so it's not like yeah I'm talking shit but it's just I can't, cause like, yo, the anxiety, imagine, I, I guess it's for more outgoing people, but like, I can't even, I think I would cry even tr going on the way to the date, cause I'd be like, oh my god, like I'm meeting a complete stranger. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. know, already thinking about it, it gives me I so know for sure anxiety. you wouldn't be able to do it. I would like, cry. Just, she's so scared of meeting strangers, let I alone would, meeting a date yeah. online. Okay, we're gonna use this color right in the bottom. I would probably throw up walking there. <laughs> Imagine. I'm pretty sure you would. Oh god. Nervous or stressed, I start picking at my cuticles. Yeah. Like this. And like I'll just go quiet and I'll just do this. And so many times Sana's like, Laba, stop freaking doing that. But I go into like this trance and picking at my cuticles makes me feel really good. And if I get it to bleed, it makes me feel even better. You're so weird. Like who Because I'm diverting the like the but attention if that makes sense. You're making yourself bleed. Yeah, that's I know, creepy. but that's weird. I know that's kind of weird. What is he doing? <laughs> He's eating something. Cheddar, whatever you have, drop it. Is it working? Yeah. Perfect. So lashes, we're gonna use makeup by Shuni. Suni, actually. Makeup by Suni. And, and which ones are these? Rolling Stone. So the ones I sent a word to her wedding are the ones that I was like obsessed with last year and they're from Nem Beauty, N-E-M Beauty. They're EOS. You guys, if you're having a wedding or a special event, you need those lashes. They're literally the best lashes ever. Are you, what are you looking for? Are you hungry? No, I'm not hungry at, at all, speaking. but my stomach keeps growling. Okay, so one thing I will say is um, always do your brow gel, I think, after. Yeah, because yeah, the, powder the powder gets, gets, gets on stuck it. to it. That's so annoying. I just remembered. I feel like I can fly. It's like a window. Wow. Lashes change up the look though. Come on. Okay, oh, ready. you guys, I'm just getting blown up by too many text messages by too many friends. Yeah, totally. I'm just gonna eat now the then digest. <laughs> okay. Was there just telling you he's eating? No, cuz he, he like, was like, do you guys update yeah, each we do, other we do when do you're that. eating and we like, do. We should have the planner. Okay, now I need a bomb ass highlighter. I just burped in my mouth. Thanks for letting uh, everyone know. We go in with the MAC Hyper Glow. Whoa. And I'm gonna use the middle one. Yeah, that's the one I use most. Clearly. And here falls one of the things. Holy moly! Oh, God. is this how I would look as a bride? Because I don't like it. Oh my God, this is how you would look as a bride. Except like with like crazy on jewelry, but we wouldn't go fully like so this is how it would be set Do we like it? Do we like is this how it's done? I'm sure people are gonna say something that was done wrong I'm trying to figure I, I see something but I think it's because we're not placing like we're not, we're not actually, like, pinning, actually it. pinning it <laughs> <laughs> I'm dying. 
Let's call your mom. Auntie? Oh god, I don't want to see Come look at Lila as a bride. Dun dun. Mashallah. Wow. <laughs> don't I look like Adab? <laughs> Like I hope so, not like hey. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna end this quickly because this shit, this is gonna fall off for the third time. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoy the look. I don't know what you guys think about this look. I think it's different, this but it's not like, live. But this is not, you know. But, but this is live. This should be my bridal bride. bridal oh my look God. for sure, and I think everyone would agree that this is. It's nice, but it's not Liba. It's, you know? it's not for you for sure. Yeah, but it's really nice. Like, Sana did such a good job. Even my mom was like, whoa, what's up with that? Thank you guys so much for watching. I want to take this out, so I'm just going to exit now. But remember to subscribe to Osama and Sana's channel, Ozara's channel, everybody's channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!